All right. Well, welcome everybody to the Global Lounge call. This is February of 2022, our Geneva Invitation Day. I'm Krista Inakovsky. Nice to have everyone here. Um, it's a Monday, which is not our normal day, but later this week, um, JBology is presenting for the very first time a brand new event called Real Deals in Real Time, which we're very excited about. It is exclusively for people who have an up and running business and offer and are ready to JV to do actual JV real deals in real time um, throughout three days together. So um, we're really, Jay and I are very excited about getting this um, going. And then for those of you who are not quite ready for this event just yet, We'll be back again in May with JVology Live. And then September, we'll be doing real deals in real time again. So you can make that a goal to be up and ready um, to do that. We have a fantastic quiz that people take. It's been, who's taken the quiz? I'm sure lots and lots of you have. I've seen you in there. Um, and it's really great to take that quiz every couple months because when you're in a community like this and you are growing and learning and doing and implementing, those scores just keep going up and up. Um, and through that um, quiz that we have, it rates you, puts you into one of three categories, and that helps us know who is ready, um, which is called our ready and refining stage. And then above that is the expert pros, the season pros. Um, hey, Krista, so did, do you have do you have the dates for September yet? Because logistically, this week is is not going to work for me. But I want to be able to plan ahead and flow around you more yes, correctly, flow I, into you. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Um, I'm going to grab those. And, yeah. and while you're doing that, JV Allergy Live dates, please. The JVology, hi Marjorie, I don't see you, but I hear your voice. Pleasure to have you there. Um, you. I'm gonna share, do one even, you know what I really need to do is get Victoria in here to be dropping some dates. Um, we'll circle back on this. I wanna keep the show on the road. Um, and then I'll, um, when Victoria's in the in the house, um, I'll come back and get you the, the dates. And we also have a date link that has all the dates for the year. And that's the one that is gonna be really helpful to you. Um, so Diana uh, Guerrero was just about to do a big, um, I think it was like a shout out slash win. And so I'd love to kick off uh, today's program with her. So Diana, the stage is yours. Hello, I'm Diana Guerrero, also known as the Art Lady. So I take people in to uh, explorations, both virtually and live variations of nature and animals. But I wanted to just do a shout out to the community because I um, am new to the community and wanted to provide um, a way for me to not just do one-on-one -on -one, um, meetings, but to jump on a call and do have coffee conversations and figure out collaborations and had a really nice show for the first one, the first Thursdays. I do it in the same same slot as Global Lounge on the first Thursday. Um, so I had multiple people sign up. One person dropped out at the last minute because of a client conflict, but um, Lene, thank you very much. Um, it was the tech glitch gremlins that really hit me hard. I still went forward and Lene actually screenshot all the, the different conversations and um, connection information for all the participants because I could not download. I mean, you name it, it happened. So a lot of people um, from JBology showed up live and we had some good conversations, getting to know one another, getting to know something that nobody else knows, some exciting things were shared. And also to kind of brainstorm, answer some questions on what people were needing. So it lasted an hour and was super fun and super useful because again, I'm trying to get to know everyone being new in the community. So thanks to everyone who attended and especially in LNA, you saved the day, let's just say. So that's it for me. And it's the first Thursday, I put a link to the next one, which is in March in the chat. That's fantastic, that that's really great. Um, and you know what, when you, whether you're new or you feel like you're new or you fell out of the loop and now you're kind of back again, 
just, just like Dan is doing, you got to put your hands up and be like, Hey, Hey, let's meet, let's talk, let's connect. Um, and put yourself out there. Cause that's why we're here. We're a great community, but only when you, um, you know, really stand up and stand out in, in work with each other. Um, and another great thing that I love you that you were mentioning there, Diana, is we're a fantastic community to have each other's back. And when you maybe you've got somebody big kind of lined up and, and for whatever reason, if somebody falls out at the last minute, this is, you know, not to say that you, you could also be each other superstars, but it's also really nice to have a couple of great relationships built in where, you know, you can be like, oh my gosh, something, you know, I just lost my, my guest speaker or this happened. Would you like to fill in? Because how many people would just on any normal day love to be seen, have their voice heard, be on a podcast, be on a show, right? So um, it's another great reason to have um, this, this great resource pool um, with each other. And, and then shout out to um, Event Raptor. I'm using that for the meetings. I'm in the beta test up for that. So use the platform. And um, even though Steve was having his summit, he actually was able to connect with me um, during that time, during all the stuff that was going on. So that was lovely. Awesome. Fantastic. Um, if you, you look at the chat there, it does look like I'm Jay, but I did just change my name. Um, with Jay's picture, um, that is our Geology Dates link. So that's gonna take you to a live page. That way, when things change um, for us, it changes in the back end. So you're not left with an old stale PDF that's from three months ago. And it has um, the Geology live dates and the real deal and real time dates, as well as pretty much everything else that goes on uh, in, our, in our world. So grab that, save that. It is also in the Global Lounge Facebook group in that all about Global Lounge. If you'll remember back to when you did a welcome call with me, showed you we have that pinned post that's called all about Global Lounge. That's where we keep these links and the Zoom link and dates and all of that, as well as office hours that I do most Wednesdays. Um, all right, so it is time to roll out some JV invitations. Super glad you're here. Get those cameras on um, and get your finger on the raise hand button in the count of three, two, one. Raise your hand if you have a JV invitation. Go faster, go faster, go faster, go faster. There, 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 there. Okay, okay. All right, so that's awesome. Um, we'll start in order. We'll go through a round of those and then take a little bit of a break. Um, let's try to keep these tight between 45 and 60 seconds. And I'll pull my um, timer up. We're going to go um, Emma, Martha, Judy, Sherelle will be our top. And then I'll take it from there when you are ready. Hello, everyone. I'm Emma Oriema McKay, architect and interior designer, known as the Dream Home Manifester and the Real Realtor's Architectural Advisor. Um, I have a podcast targeted to real estate people, and most of my guests are business people who teach strategies, skills, and that kind of thing that real estate people can use. So if you are one of those people, I would love to feature you on the podcast. It's called real estate professionals. I'll leave my email in the chat here and we can catch up and see if you're fit. So I'd love to hear from you. Fantastic. I would love for everyone, if you, if whether you're taking, if you take notes, if you have something on your computer, as somebody speaks, what's that one word that stands out and identifies so that you can start just tracking? So what would be the one word you heard from Emma? Did anybody come up with real estate? Uh, real estate is two words, but that's what I was going to say, but I'm thinking. <laughs> oh, <one>. Judy. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah, so you, I encourage everyone to have that thing, like whether it's, you know, get that single or compound word or very short phrase that you get known for. And then that way you become recognizable. People start to associate your name, face, and that um industry perhaps and that way you're like oh i got to remember i got to circle back and talk to emma more about that find out what she really does in this space because i know people who are there as well let's get to know her further 
All right, great, Emma, thank you so much. Um, and we also will have um, in the Facebook group a reminder for you to put all of your links there, but you can go ahead and drop them here like you did, fantastic. All right, Martha is up next. Hey, so my JV invitation today is actually a little to the left of what I normally do, but if you are someone who likes to have intimate getaways with a small group of your highest and best clients, I have a property that's going to be available and perfect for such a thing coming up. It's going to be available as early as March of this year. And I, what I'm looking to get out of it is some great reviews on uh, Airbnb and or feedback if your experience there is not great. So I can, let's just say, have your investment be entirely reasonable for the use of the fully furnished property, ultimate gathering space, super high speed internet there, um, gorgeous environment. So uh, you can reach me to talk about it more, Martha at MarthaAWilson.com and I'll drop it in the chat. Awesome. Can you share with us what part of the world this amazing place may be? It is in Abingdon, Virginia, which is just off the Appalachian Trail. Um, Appalachian Trails, um, ultimate uh, local Virginia historic trails are there. Um, there is a winery nearby. So think, think rural, think mountains, think beautiful, think springtime, think fall time, um, think summer hiking, think great fishing, great biking those kinds of experiences. Great. How fun. Thanks for sharing such uh, something that's outside of your, your norm, but uh, like many of us here, you have multiple businesses happening. That's great. That's good. You know, I know you also um, are in the middle of the launch right now. Is that right? I am. I am in the middle of the launch. It's for business people who are struggling with those increasing pressures of success. And the webinar is called all the webinar is is three hidden reasons your calendar is setting you up to fail and what to do about it. Awesome. So if that resonates with anyone, um, then reach out to Martha directly to have a further conversation about that one. Yeah. All right. Affiliate, affiliate info is all set up for that. So I can hook you up in a matter of two minutes or less if it's a fit for you and your people. Fantastic. Love it. All right. Judy Weintraub, how are you today? Uh, I'm doing very well. Thank you. Um, my business is Skill Bites. I help business owners and professionals write and publish books. And I am running a summit in March on book writing, publishing and monetizing or prospering from your book. So I would love to have affiliates to help me to promote that. I will be doing a leaderboard. So there'll be prizes for the people who bring in the most registrants. And I will put information about that in the chat. All right, fantastic, great summit ahead. Wonderful. Yeah, uh, Martha, we need your information in the chat in order to reach you. I'm typing quickly as we speak. <laughs> All right, wonderful. Um, Sherelle. Hi there, um, I'm Sherelle Morris. This is my actual first actual JV offer. Um, I have a six month program called Circle of Power. It's based on sort of a mastermind program. And my focus is to women who work in tech, focusing on um, security, infosec, and also open source. Sorry, got nervous. Um, it is a six month program. It's a limit of eight women. We've gone through, we're halfway through our beta and it's amazing. This is not teaching them like hard tools. Maybe. Sorry. Keep going. Keep going. Finish it. Um, good. It's the soft. It's understanding how to use their own energy and their own inner strength. The commission is $1,200. So it's not something you mail out to 5,000 people, but think about people in your group for whom this may work and you will be helping them to lift up into their own world. 
and you have the option of taking your commission and donating it to one of several nonprofits that support women and women of diversity moving into tech. My information will be in the little chat area over here, and I would love to talk with you about it. And I will have uh, all the written stuff in by the end of the week. Thank you. All right. All right. So the keywords we're looking here are women in tech, mastermind, and you're going to help them uh, elevate. Like you, you've got some, some woo-woo that fits into the tech and yes. blends beautifully and brings out more. Yes. I've All right. So that, that's, that's going to be my, my job today. I'm going to listen and see if I can pull out in a, like a couple of words that that's, that's Sherelle. Thank you. All right. Awesome. Jill, you're up next, followed by Kathleen Panning. Can you unmute Jill? There you go. There we go. Sorry. Um, yeah, so thank you for um, everybody being here. I'm really excited about, <clears throat> since I can't talk very well, just getting through COVID. <clears throat> um, I have an online course, a live online course coming up in March. On March 17th, it launches its seven weeks. And in February, on the 14th, I'll be doing my webinar to invite people to uh, enroll for the course. It's $297. And if I enroll one of your people, um, I will give you $100 per person. And the topic is thriving caregivers. It's discovered the essential principles of effective self-care to replenish your energy, confidence, and patience. And so I think that's about it. And I'll drop my information in the box. All right, Jill. So thriving caregivers. Um, have you met Elizabeth Magalon Flurry from our community? I have. I have interviewed her on my Facebook page and she did fabulous. Excellent. Yeah, we're good buds by now. <laughs> good, good. Just making sure. That's great. Yeah, um, that all right. Girl. Love it. All right. So it'll be Kathleen Panning followed by Lene Shadid Christie. Then we'll take a quick pause before continuing. Um, I'm launching my first coaching program coming up uh, end of this month, but next week I have a mastermind leading into that. Uh, the mastermind's free, the six months coaching program. Uh, there's a 10% commission on that for $100 for anybody who signs up for the program. And it's around story. And the master, uh, the master class is uh, using your story to increase your impact and revenue. And so I just finished with a five-day challenge with 79 people uh, to learn how to tell their story. And so this is the next step in using that in many different ways to increase your impact and your revenue. Um, my email is in the chat and uh, I'm looking for people to be affiliates for that. So if you let me know, I would appreciate that if you could send out a couple of emails this week. I also have a weekly radio show and podcast. Several of you have been on there already and it's targeted anything and everything that could possibly be related to uh, faith communities. So Jill, what you do would be perfect for that. Uh, and anybody else, if you're interested, contact me, please. All right, excellent, excellent, excellent. So a mastermind, a group, um, all about story. And uh, Kathleen has a radio show that is geared towards uh, faith leaders of all different faiths. Fabulous. Um, Lynette, you're up. Thanks. So I offer, I have, um, I do bookkeeping services for online entrepreneurs who are looking to get more clarity around their cash flow, their profitability, and where their business is going six, 12, two years down the road, however far they want to look out to make sure that they're going to be able to be profitable. So I offer 20% commissions on monthly bookkeeping packages that are done for you. I will drop the link to partner in the chat 
as well as a link to my one pager so you can find out more. All right. Excellent. So bookkeeping. Um, all right, give me, give me like what one main thing do you like problem do you like to solve for people with their bookkeeping? Where is they like, ah, and then you're like, ah, I totally have this. I would be making sure that you are correctly categorizing your expenses each month so that you are ready for tax time in January and not May. All right. So you want to stay on time with all this. Excellent. Yeah, that's um, that's where the headaches come in and we, we wait to the last minute and try to do it all. <laughs> all right, fantastic. Uh, Shadid, you're up. Thank you, Krista. Great afternoon. Shadidi Laser. I'm a leading authority in developing ideas into intellectual property and monetizing it using content licensing partnerships with universities and corporations. Backed by popular demand, I'm reopening the doors for content licensing fundamentals on Tuesday, March 1st. This is ideal for lists of coaches, experts, authors, speakers with the opportunity to earn up to $200 per registered student. I'm seeking podcasts, mastermind groups, and email promotions for the launch of content licensing fundamentals. Follow-up details are in the chat. <coughs> All right. So um, tell us, we have a lot of people in here who are good potential partners for you that maybe haven't even thought about uh, licensing their content. Uh, where would somebody be right now? They're like, hey, this is a good time for you to have this conversation. I have a book, I have a course, I have a service that I deliver and I want to monetize it without my own sweat and labor. Right, that's fantastic, thanks Shadid. You're welcome. All right, so we'll, um, we'll do Christy and then take a, a pause with another question and we'll circle back after that. You're All ready? right. Yeah, well, hello, everybody. I am excited. I haven't been on a call for a while. Um, so it's great to see some faces. I am Christy Rippino, Master Story Activator. I have been helping women and men for the last eight years um, identify their signature story and use it to attract, captivate, and convert more prospects, prospects into paying clients. And I do that with a specific vehicle of an anthology book. And um, we not only do them for our clients, but one of the things that I'm really excited about is helping experts create an, an anthology project for their brand. So if you know anybody that's an expert that has a big tribe and would love to add a co-authored book project to their revenue stream, um, we project manage the whole thing. I pay a $1,000 upfront commission. And what I will do is I will put my uh, scheduling link and my JV partner sign up page link in the chat and we can connect. Thank you. Awesome, that's great, Christy. Um, all right, so we'll, we'll pause and come back, but I wanna give everybody a moment to um, really think about who you've met so far. Who's done the JV invitation? What are those kind of keywords like we talked about where you get to know if you've, if you've blurred on everything else, because I know what happens, but you get that, that kind of one main thing and their name and their face, you're getting to know them. Um, I'll open up the floor, especially those who haven't talked, but even if you have, um, who are you interested in having more of a conversation with? Just keep it real quick. Just be like, hey, what Chrissy just said was amazing. I definitely need to talk to her. So go for it. Just unmute, kind of throw your hand up in the air. Christy? Well, I would love to have Shadid for sure on my podcast. And I want to definitely give a special thanks to Barbara because she was on my podcast that episode last that. It was aired last week and she's gotten a ton and ton, a ton of great reviews about um, her single strategies to help people that are single to make better connections. Awesome, good, good. All right, who else? Who's, who wants, ready to ask more, Judy? Yeah, um, well, Shadid's program is a good fit for my audience. So I uh, put in the chat, chat that I would be happy to promote his program. Uh, I can put that in my February newsletter. And I'm not sure if I'm a good fit for Emma, but um, maybe some of your 
uh, real estate professionals would be interested in writing books and I could be on your podcast to uh, teach them a little bit about how to get a book done. Great. All right. All right. Who else? Show that you're thinking. Shadid and then Barbara. Uh, Judy has a um, summit coming up and I actually have two calls today with people and they're uh, perfect alignment. So I need to um, connect the dots with uh, that. Also, uh, Christy and uh, Emma's uh, podcast, we can talk um, uh, intellectual property uh, from a real estate context. So um, a few other people as well, but um, I'll let them do their introductions and go from there. All right. Good, good. Barbara. Actually, I wanted to respond to Christy and just thank her for the opportunity of being on our podcast. It was super fun. And if you haven't listened to Christy's podcast, you need to listen to it. She is such a gracious interviewer. She is just so easy to have a flowing conversation with. And uh, thank you so much, Christy. It was such a great experience. Wonderful, good, good. So um, as we continue doing the JV invitations, um, try this, what, uh, who, whatever you're getting from the person, Pick one person you know that you think kind of is the right avatar that they're looking for, they, whether it's they could be a potential JV partner. Again, we want to try to be listening enough that we're grounding this in to a place that we're not just all sharing, talking, and we're not receiving. We have to have to be um, the ones that are willing to reach out and go, that really sounded interesting. Or I think... I'm thinking you're saying this, but are you really like, we, we need to be willing to reach out to each other for clarity um, on what it is that each other does. And so try as we do these next few, think of an actual person, a friend, a client that you know, and just kind of ground and go, oh, okay. So when Sherelle was talking about women in tech who you know are good at what they do, but they're kind of out there like, oh, that reminds me of my friend. Lori, who's in tat, and, and you start to ground in what we're talking about in, into your own world, your own reality, so that we can begin making deeper and stronger connections. Okay. Sound good? We're going to try it. All right. So if, if you've already talked, spoken, lower your hands. If you're here for JV invitation, get those hands up and we'll, Barbara Cates, if you're ready, we'll start with you and then followed by Schroeder. Hey there, everybody. My name is Barbara Cates, and I typically come to you as a dating and relationship coach, and I'm changing hats today. And one of my other specialties is an interpersonal communication specialist. And I'm here actually today to just get some uh, general interest to see if some people are interested. One of the things I've done for years is called an unnetworking event. It's basically a networking event where you can't talk about business. And it's super fun. And the reason that I'm asking for your input today is I'm wondering if members of Global Lounge would like me to put one on for our community. So basically, you get to have fun conversations like, tell me one fun and cool thing you'd never know about you just by looking at you. For me, I used to be a, uh, a flute player in a rock and roll band in university. So it's just getting to know people in a fun way in your community to see if you click as human beings and then you have conversations about business afterwards. So I'm looking for like a yes or a no in the chat of who might be interested for uh, me putting on an event probably in March for the Global Lounge community for us to just get to know each other in just a super fun way. Oh, look at all those yeses. Sweet. All right. So Good. I will, um, maybe I can connect with you, Krista, and you could let me know when might be a good time to do that. And yeah, look, forward that. To, great. look forward to getting to know you guys in a more personal way. Thank you. Awesome. Absolutely. Yeah. See, I love that. You know, Barbara stepping out a little bit. Um, Martha was stepping out from her normal. You know, we're, we're, we are multidimensional, well-rounded people, and it's great to show up um, in different ways and see, you know, hey, who's hitting for what? And I could tell that everyone was doing a really great job of listening to Barbara because we got some fantastic reactions right there off the bat. Um, good, good. All right. Um, that means Schroeder is up next. How's it going for you today? 
Just fine, thank you, darling. How are you? Lovely to see everybody. A networking event that you don't have to network? That sounds perfect. I <laughs> love it. <laughs> perfect, Barbara. I'll be there. Um, so this would be my first time. So hold on a second here. Let me just pull up. So I'm a voice coach and I, sorry. I said, yeah, just get, get that JV invitation up and yeah. uh, the floor is yeah, all So I'd love to invite anybody who works with, I'm looking for JV partners um, to, so anybody who works. So what I do is I help um, multi-passionate, you know, entrepreneurs and speakers, leaders of any field, uh, develop confidence uh, and accessing more of their basically voice potential um, so that when they show up, they have more impact and confidence and <laughs> conviction. That's my program. I offer a 30% um, a referral fee and I'll drop my info in the chat with my calendar link. Would that be the best way to do it? Yes, for you're gonna drop your link in the calendar your calendar okay. link in the chat. Um, okay. We also will be posting a brand new um, February JV invitation uh, post in Facebook that you can add um, your things to as well. Oh, and that just quickly reminds me is that I'm starting a new group on Monday, the 14th Valentine's Day, just in time for Valentine's. So for a gift for yourself or a loved one, I just finished up my previous group. And one of the main, one of the big comments was, uh, you know, as we wrapped it up was, uh, this was such a good gift for myself, my one client said. So it's it's as much for your business as uh, it could be for just yourself. Not you, your JV people. Does that, the people that you bring to me. Okay. I'm You're getting there. All right. Welcome. <laughs> You're always a hoot. Um, Adriana, thank you so much for dropping the Facebook uh, group link in the chat. Appreciate it. That shortcut's nice. Um, and, all right. So we're just going to, I'm testing everyone today. I'm making you work hard. So drop one word that that uh, connects with Schroeder. What did you hear? One or you know two. We can do two words and call it one. What kind of either like what does he do? Who does he help? Does any anything you picked up on? Voice, voice impact, voice confidence, voice coach, voice coach, voice confidence. All right, all right, good, good. Awesome, awesome. Fantastic, we're heading in the right direction. Mr. Hawk Mikado, how's it going today in Funneltopia? And he muted. Hello, there we go, you can hear me. My name is Hawk Mikado, I'm the Funnel Gamer and we are looking for partners with lists of coaches, entrepreneurs, business owners, company leaders that wanna add thousands of leads to their list and then systematically convert them into paying clients and add six figures to their business. Uh, we do this through our signature lead flow engine and which is a list building and sales conversion engine. Uh, we've got more, more things to promote than you can probably imagine. Uh, and our best JVs are business coaches, event uh, coordinators, event creators, copywriters. And then we tend to, uh, if our downstream, I think that's right, downstream, we, uh, we refer to a lot of specialized agencies. I'll drop my info in the chat there, which has link to learn more as well as commission camps. Do you uh, want to connect? Messenger or Facebook is by far the fastest way to do so. All right, all right. So uh, Hawk's an easy one. I think we all know what Hawk does, do we? Any questions? <laughs> all right, Hawk is our funnel guy. Um, it's provided a lot of great value here at Geology. Appreciate the stuff that you um, do. Um, all right, so where are my hands? Who else has a JV invitation? All right, so we're gonna move on and have a little bit more fun today. Um, the next question is, who do you wanna meet that you haven't met yet that's in this room? We'll just keep it real quick and be like, Schroeder, I need an appointment with you because I need to know about vo voice coaching. Done, like that's what I wanna hear, okay? so. Who have you, you've maybe introduced, but, or you didn't follow through all the way. Who do you want to know that's in the room and get to know more? Shout it out and make sure you connect. Ready, set, go. Wave your hand. Christy. 
Christy Rufino, I have heard great things about you. I also am fascinated at how many people are doing completely different angles on story. So I look forward to connecting and finding out more about that. Thanks. Wonderful, Zola. Good, good. Fantastic. We've got Michelle. Glad you could make it, Michelle. Hey, I would love to hook up with Hawk because um, usually by the time he's done, that would be a perfect downline referral for me because then they typically want a virtual assistant to start taking over their tasks because their business is growing. So um, Hawk would be a perfect person for me to connect with. Super. All right, Hawk and Michelle Thompson connect. Great. Diana, who do you want to meet? Also Hawk. I um, did a reference to him the last week and I have um, audiences I'm involved in that are in his um, list of others to serve. So I'm hot conversation. All right, sounds great. Sherelle. Um, actually three. Michelle, I think we need to talk accounting. Barbara, another person on this call that I won't name, and I've discussed having a chill day after JV Live, JVology Live. We might want to put all that together. And where did that go? Ah, Schroeder. Um, I would love to talk about potentially having you as a guest for my, my, my women. <laughs> and it's only eight, so. We need to talk and see if that's viable um, because as you're moving up in a corporate world, you have to be able to express yourself better. Mm. Perfect. Love that. Yeah, that sounds fine. I've got my calendar chat or link okay. in the chat. And, perfect, uh, perfect. The chat's open. You can even um, DM people privately if you need to. Uh, we've got those open today. Yeah. Cool. Great. Awesome, Cheryl. Um, so we've got... We He's not open. He's not open. Oh, sorry. Is it just to me? I'm getting DMs that, that, because that's, I'm the host. Yep. Um, all right. Well, then just put it out there. Just put an out at sign at the person you're talking to and share their information. There's nothing private we're sharing anyway. Um, mm -hmm. Hi, Victoria, by the way. Nice to have you here. Hey, everyone. Um, <laughs> Martha. I can find my unmute button. So I would love to connect with Carrie because I too was in the leadership mind space, am in the leadership mindset success space. And I would love to see if there are places where we complement and don't compete. Um, so I'd love to connect with you. And uh, yeah, there's a whole other, I've got a whole list of people that I'm going to reach out to <laughs> after today. I'd love to do that, Martha. That sounds great. Awesome. Thanks. By the way, if you can't find how to uh, mute and unmute and you're on a PC, the easiest way is the Alt key plus the A, Alt A, and video is Alt B. Now, you on Max or whatever, no clue. <laughs> Thank you, Marjorie. That was such a nice, helpful tent, uh, um, tip. You're handy with the tech tips, tech tips. Appreciate it. All right. so. Um, up next, we're doing Who I Want to Meet. We've got Kathleen Panning followed by Christy Rufino. Um, Schroeder, I think you would be a great guest on my radio show uh, talking with faith leaders because they have to use their voice a lot. <laughs> and uh, they um, how to maximize that without straining and overusing, which can get to be a problem for some. Uh, so. Uh, my info is in the chat for an email uh, as well. And um, carry leadership. Again, that's something that faith leaders need to learn. Some of them are not very good leaders. So anything to talk about leadership would be uh, welcome information on the radio show. And for all of you who've been on my show in the past, I want to let you know that I now know that your information has reached six continents all except antarctica so hey come on, let's, uh, give, her, let's give kathleen a big round of applause. I, that's huge yeah. well yeah, done so six uh, continents. it's it's expanding so wonderful thank you that's that's great congratulations uh, all right so christy marjorie and then adriana 
Well, I am really looking to connect with Martha. Um, one of the things I really just wanted to point out, even though I've been in the community for a long time, I'm still like my mind is still being opened up to new opportunities every time I'm on one of these calls. And that's what I really love about it. Not only new people, but it makes me think of things that I never thought of. And I know Schroeder, I made a really great connection for him, um, getting him to have his program embedded into a client's program. And now I'm thinking, well, why the heck can I do that with my program? And so it's just, when we hear things from different perspectives, it gives us better ideas. So I just, I just love these calls. Awesome. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Christy. I mean, honestly, that, that's, that really is the fun. I know you've mentioned this mm -hmm. before, Christy, uh, that I've, I've heard you. Um, you know, you've been in our flow mastery program for almost a year now. And, and it, it was a little clunky in the beginning. It's kind of like, like what, why am, what am I doing? Why am I here? What am I getting out of this? Yep. And you kept with it and then I'll let you finish the, like, how does, how is that experience? Like just take like in a year at a glance, how is that uh, so, process? Been? Yeah, I was definitely, you know, getting ready to get ready kind of a thing for a long time. Uh, but what I did is I just kept showing up and inviting everybody onto my podcast. <laughs> so it's just like, whatever I can do to serve and support and really get to see who's sticking around. Cause for me, it's about the loyalty. And when you see somebody show up once or twice, or they only show when they want to pitch something and you never see them again. For me, I don't want those kind of relationships. I want to build relationships with people that are going to be around for a while and then stay committed to each other. And as I continue to learn from everybody else, I'm mimicking what they're doing and success leaves clues. So I've learned just as much. I, I know I see Jay's face, so I'm not sure if he's listening. He's listening. I've, I've learned, he's in I've the learned, car just as much of from everybody else in this community as I've learned from my coaching calls with him. So it's all just brilliant. I am listening and that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> he speaks. <laughs> the, the, the hidden voice from above comes in. Everyone's like, wait, wait, where has he been? <laughs> Jay's, Jay's driving today, so he's, but he's, he's here and listening. Um, awesome, all right, so Marjorie and then Adriana. She, she's misplaced the alt a or whatever the command was that you gave us Marjorie, you're still on mute we can't hear you here i told everybody how to do it and i didn't do it myself Duh. i i need one of those little uh uh emojis with the the eye roll emoji right now uh, <laughs> Anyway, what I have in the, in the chat is my email address and my calendar link. I'd like to connect with Martha to see if I can't uh, support her launch. I've, I've got some emails going out right around now, but if I can, I'd like to. Christy, I'd love to be on your podcast. Uh, Hawk, I'd love to promote some of your stuff as well. And if anybody else has a podcast where you would like somebody who is, uh, I, I'm a communication confidence coach and I help people figure out uh, what to say, how to present it so you don't put people to sleep and don't use a terrible voice. Uh, <laughs> Schroeder and I do the same kind of thing in that regard and also help people overcome uh, the fear of actually opening their mouth. And I'm not uh, promoting anything myself right now. My husband just passed away last month, so, but I'm glad to promote other people. Thank you. I appreciate you showing up, Marjorie. You're so sweet. And Marjorie, so sorry to hear about your loss. I literally just found out like a day and a half ago and my heart goes out to you. Um, I just, it's anything we can do to support you, let us know. 53 years Thank of marriage. Thank you very much. No, let's 52 give, years. Give some days. love, 52 years. And of, two days. Yes, two we, days. we got married on Super Bowl Sunday 4 at 2 p.m., which had two results. Number one, it was a short wedding reception. And number two, I'm the only non-football fan who could always tell you the number of the Super Bowl because all I had to do was add four to the number of years we were married. So this year is Super Bowl 56. Aww. Beautiful, <laughs> beautiful life, beautiful story. All right. Um, all right. So we're going to conclude our Who I Want to Meet. We'll do Adriana, Roy, and Barbara, and then we'll pause there.
Okay. <clears throat> I'm Adriana Steinwedel, and let's see who I want to meet. I know some prof real estate professionals that Emma might want on her podcast, so we ought to connect. Um, and I wanted to uh, meet. I wanted to meet with Carol Hodges um, from before. I know kind of what she's doing, and I think I could reach some people who might, uh, you know, she might be able to help. And let's see, Jill, I know we need to talk again. And I was thinking I'd love to get together with Zola. I keep seeing Zola on different things, but we've never really talked and connected. Uh, so I'd like to do that as well. Awesome. Very good. Thank you. All right, Roy, who do you want to meet? Uh, I want to meet Diana. Uh, we both do her tours. And uh, so, Diana, if you could put uh, your contact information in the chat, that would be great. And I can reach out and we can connect and talk tours. Okay. All right. Good stuff. And Barbara, who do you want to meet? I would love to meet uh, Marjorie. Marjorie. My sincere condolences to you and thank you for being here. As my put on my interpersonal communication hat again, uh, one of the things that I uh, work a lot with people on is understanding body language. What are the signals you're giving off, how you're approachable, and what are the signals that other people are sending you non-verbally? So when you were talking about the communications, the confidence with communications, I thought there is a perfect marriage. So. Uh, I would love to connect with you and just talk about how we may have some overlap and dovetail and how we can help each other. All right. Excellent. I love that. It's that, um, you know, thinking outside of the box and uh, putting some, some cool synergies together. And sometimes, you know, often that comes before actually doing a JV project. You may not have something that you're pitching, but you start with the collaboration, um, sharing information to an audience, and that can be a great start. Um, all right, so we have 10 minutes left. What I'd love to do now is open up the floor to anyone who has not spoken yet. And instead of doing a full JV invitation, because I figured if you had one of those, you would have done it already. You probably don't have an invitation to make, but we do want to do that, the name, the face, and the main thing that you do, recognition. So super short and concise, just be like, hey, I'm Krista, and I'm the one who leads these awesome calls. <laughs> so... Um, so that way, again, we can go, oh, I should probably meet her. I should meet him. And then you meet offline. So if you haven't spoken yet, jump on in there and give us um, that memorable thing that we need to know you for. And we will go with Carol, one of our awesome crypto uh, endeavor heroes. <laughs> yes, my crypto is it's working. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm Carol Hodges, and my book, The Menopause Millionaire, just launched on February 1st, and today I'm celebrating that it is number two on the, some of the new releases. Come on, everybody. Show her some love. That's huge. <laughs> Here we go. If you don't think you want to read it, today would be a good day to go get it. Maybe we can get to number one. <laughs> <laughs> Whether you're in menopause or you know someone, buy them the right. book. <laughs> Even men have said they enjoyed it. So uh, they probably need a more than the women to know who they're dealing with. <laughs> so where can we find it? And you Amazon? can find it the best places on Amazon because that's where I'm ranking. It will be other okay. places as well, but Today, I'm really wanting to rank on Amazon. So that would be the best place. Great. Well, if you have a direct link, put it in the chat or at least the, the name. I, I, I will. It's actually better to, uh, to look, it look up at it. But let me put it down there and you'll have it. Okay. If you just give us the name, is if it is better for us to go into our own app and tap in, type in the name and get it, then we'll, we can be sure to do that. That's fantastic. Yeah. It's The Menopause Millionaire. And I'll, I'll type it in. Fantastic. All right. Congratulations. Ivano, how are you feeling, my friend? I am well, thank you. And a pleasure Welcome. to be here, sir. It was late earlier today. Um, I'm excited about offering uh, my beta program, the seven keys to seven figures. I've announced it previously. 
Uh, it's going to go on uh, February 22nd. I believe it's Tuesday, February 22nd. We're going to start that. I have about uh, six people signed up. There's room for a few more. And I'll uh, put the information uh, in the chat and I'll also post it in the, in the group. Awesome. Fantastic. All right. And Howard, how are you? Hello, everybody. Hello. Um, well, my name is Howard Samble. I'm the director of Life Crafting. Our primary focus is helping people transition from boring jobs that they've outgrown to making money doing what they love and living a fulfilled life. My primary focus here, however, is our cryptocurrency startup program that you probably have heard me talk about in the past. So my interest is to share that later uh, and uh, connect with people who want to join our team, our marketing partner, become a marketing partner with us. Awesome. Yeah, you've got some great stuff going on there. You did a fantastic uh, crypto workshop last week and uh, making some really cool things happen, connecting um, crypto with your life's purpose as well. You've got some cool synergies happening. Yeah, and Crystal was our MCA. <laughs> Yay, good stuff. <laughs> Stuff. All right, moving right along, let's try to wrap this up. We've got Carrie. Nice to see you, Carrie. Krista, I can't see stuff. Can I go after Carrie as well just because I'm driving? Yes, we'll do Carrie, Jay, and then Adriana. Thanks. I'm Carrie Gaston. I'm in Austin, Texas, and I work with executives and professionals that are in transition or they're just really wanting to up their level in their business, our career, our life, uh, and they are stuck. Uh, with my uh, proven uh, leadership mindset success system, I really help them be really clear about uh, what they want, uh, interact with others for true communication, and then just really shift their leadership levels up so people will be inspired by them uh, I uh, so that they can achieve uh, greater success, achieve their goals quicker, and with more joy and more fulfillment. Uh, right now, I'm uh, uh, on the second section, the second three months of my a mastermind, my new mastermind. Uh, and I have about five people that are continuing out of about 11, which is great because they're exactly the people I want. So I'm trying to find four or five uh, more uh, mid to high level professionals and um, and executives to join on board. Uh, so I'd love to hear if, if you have any recommendations on that. And then also um, I'm hoping to get something online up with my courses in maybe two months and uh, hopefully get some, uh, help with that. So thank you so much. Great to meet everybody today. All right. Fantastic. All right. Jay Fizet, you are up. Hey gang, it's been great to be able to stoop and listen. And Krista, thank you for running a fabulous call. I truly appreciate that. Um, basically, I wanted to do two things. One of which is, and I know you've probably already uh, mentioned the uh, real deals in real time coming up Wednesday through Friday. And gang, any of you who are ready for that program, juggle your lives and get your butt to that. I, I have been really working hard on a new, deep, powerful, and fast uh, process that uh, if you're in that stage, come hang out with us, you'll be thrilled that you did. So that, that was number one reminder, just because honestly, my head has been buried in the creation of that, and I'm very excited about it. And then number two, I, I have an accidental JV invitation that I want to repeat here, <laughs> which is, I started building um, GPU mining machines for myself and my boys. Um, and then Michael Beely said, well, would you build one for me? And then my brother-in-law, well, would you build one for me? And then Matthew McGregor, would you build one for me? So anyway, I, and I have one more after that, a gentleman named Scott. Um, anyway, the long and the short of it is this, is I am neck deep in building GPU miners for Ethereum primarily. And if you're interested in co-owning a miner, uh, if you want to invest some money, I'll secure the cards, I'll build it, I'll manage it, I'll maintain it, I'll do all those sorts of things, and uh, we split the money. 80-20 for you until the, your initial investment is paid, and then 50-50 after that, and we just take care of it all. Um, if something weird like that is interesting, um, while I'm building the other ones, I can build a couple more. It's one of those things where a very small amount of additional effort while you're in it uh, has a whole additional rig and machine built. So if you're interested in that, send me a PM. All right, I threw that in the chat. Um, if you're connected with Jay, do that. Otherwise, you can um, reach out to me and just say, hey, I want to know more about Jay and the uh, GPU miners. 
And if you're like, I don't know what that is, then either look it up, do a little research, or maybe it's not for you, <laughs> but it could be. It, it, we never knew any of this until recently. So look it up. Yeah, it's machines that actually mine Ethereum. So when we were complaining about paying minor fees, well, we can be on the other end of that and earn minor fees. Very cool. Sherelle, do you have a comment on that one? And then we'll, we'll get it. Yeah, go ahead. Well, it's, it's sort of a in, NTF comment. Is it NFT? NFT. <laughs> this morning on the news, they brought in John Lennon's son, who is going through all of the memories of his father and the Beatles and going through NFT to put them out into the world. Ah. Oh. Interesting. A big chunk of something. Big chunk of something. Yeah. Like all the guitars. All right. All written on a piece of paper. Oh, crazy, crazy. All right. Let's finish this up with Adriana. Thanks for having your hand raised. And then we'll wrap things up. Okay. <clears throat> I'm Adriana Steinwedell. And what I do is I help uh, women over 50 lower their blood sugar so that they don't even get close to uh, getting type 2 diabetes. So if anyone knows of a, a health-oriented podcast, uh, that would be wonderful. Um, I've done a few podcasts and they've been a lot of fun. Great, great. Super topic, really important. Uh, fantastic. And I know we have people in our community who work with that age group, so it's always a good tie-in. And do you know what the what the investment is for the mine for the minor project that Jay just mentioned? Are you still here, Jay? It, yeah, I sure am. It depends on how complex and high end you want to go. As little as five thousand or as high as fifteen. Completely up to you. We select the GPUs based on your profile and how much you want. I see. Thank you. All right. Good. Great question. All right, everybody. Everyone, I'd like to thank you so much for being here and joining us for JBology's Global Lounge February. Um, if you're saying bye, say bye. And I will, um, we got a lot of amazing things happening. If you think you can do real deals in real time, then uh, join us, DM if you have questions. And we look forward to seeing you um, at our next gathering. I'm just going to say that I have something in the chat so you guys can see my link tree. It's got a bunch of things. Grab the chat that everybody head over to Facebook and drop all your stuff in the February post. Um, you can do your link trees, your scheduling links if you want, and make sure you're using the Facebook um, group to interact with each other. It's there for thank you. you. Everybody, thank you, Krista. Well, thank you. My pleasure.